Welcome back to Crystal Amor's channel. And here we are having the October Barn Tour update. And we had a huge update today. And I just wanted to show you. And then monthly we will make a barn tour. So, hey Mackenzie, Garrett, and Amaya, and probably my sister. And so, we're going to have a fun day. <laughs> Just doing a barn tour. I moved stuff around, rearranged stuff, made stuff, and it was just awesome. So, here is our sign. <coughs> you will see. When you come in, it stands for um, our logo, which is Snowflake Skies for Mountainside Ranch. That's like our thing, and we like to get sky entertainment stuff, and you'll see that in a minute. So, let's start at the really front. Here is just the front side. This truck is not always here. They're just going to ship this horse, and I made him a little um, trailer by myself, and you may be asking, how is he going to get out like this? Um, you just take the top on and off, and I made a little hook inside, and it's big enough for two horses, and I made also a little window. Um, one of the bars is kind of hanging out. I'll have to glue that later, and then I just glued that together to make it look like a little door or something. Can't open it. Everything's glued. Oh my gosh. Why did it do that? The wheel busted. Set it up on the truck. There we go. The wheel busted, I guess. I had to make them out of cardboard, but I'll make some, like, a good wheel for it. Then, as always, the Mountainside Ranch sign. We just have these two baby unicorns in here for some reason. Well, Pegasus. And, like, here's the area where we keep stuff that says statues, you know. And here is one of our sky entertainment things. If you look, Mountainside Ranch is a big fan of Sky Entertainment. And I made this jump by myself. And there's just our little jump and self storage. You know, it's all. It's all that. And you know something weird in the tap box. Yes, we have lots of new things in the tap box. Lots. Um, wait, let me get the pink hook. It's, a, it's stuck. It's so big. Daddy made it so big. Ah, need to get it out of here. Give me a second, guys. Okay, there. Finally got it out. And we have, to show first, we have a little shampoo bottle. You just take a stick and put it through a little hole and stuff and make it... We'll do lots of DIY videos in the future on how to make this stuff if you think it's cool. Then we have a little sledgehammer if you need to knock down something. Put that down. And then you know about the little easy to make brush I showed in my last barn tour video, which was my September barn tour video. And then we have... A little can of, can't really see it, there we go, Breeze Horse Wax, which is um, the person who, like, does Sky Entertainment stuff. So, Sky Entertainment also makes cleaners. It's just a little brand me and my family made up for my stuff. And then just this huge pink hoof pick. To make hoof picks, you can bend the nail and, like, put the little pink thing on it. It's how we make most of the stuff that looks kind of like that. And then we made a little, um, um, what do you call those things? Uh, let me pause the video real quick. I finally got it after about four, three minutes or two. Um, it's called one of those, um, screwdrivers, yeah, screwdriver. We have a little screwdriver. And then we have another hoof pick. Purple one. And then we have a little clipper. If a nail goes up into a horse's hoof with a um, little, I uh, can't think of things tonight. Um, 
Well, a horseshoe, I couldn't think of it there. A little horseshoe, if a nail goes up into it, you can use these to get the nail out without hurting the horse. So, there's that. Moving on to the next. And then we have a little gate, and you remember in the last video that. But now we're going to move over to our hallway. Here we have a little hallway, and you have to go over the bridge if you want to get to certain places. Not now. From our last video, I think we still have our unicorns in here. I haven't got to spend much time decorating and stuff, but I have got to spend a little time. And then you know the outside paddocks. And then here's something that looks unfamiliar. We have a little barn right here made out of cardboard. Let me get the camera set up. I moved my barn out here where it's more bright. And we have this little hook. We have this little hook. And you can take it on and off. And we use a paper clip for the little hinge where you can lock the stuff on. Oh my gosh, this is so hard how he made it. <gasps> and then you can just take that off and it's automatically glued to that. And your horse can come in and out with this. Or if you don't want him to come in or out, you can always just clasp it back. So that little hook is that. And then we have a little window here in the stall. And we have... Sam in here. <coughs> then you have the little back gate, and I'll turn it around now. And just around back is the little gate. And so that is that, basically. From that and you remember that so here's where Sam's baby he can't be with his dad right now so West is with chocolates in there with his blanket on. and then we have little joy our little barn rabbit She's so cute and then we have the little statue and Matilda too our chicken and um, some of our barn owls are moved over there, you have saw. And then we have that and that hay. And then just coming through the barn, you remember that probably from our last video. And remember that from our last video, yep. And then there's Scarlet. And we just use a little butter can. And we took a Ritz Crackers, and we cut out the tiny logo, it took a Ritz Crackers cardboard box, little box they come in, and then we just cut out the rest around it, and there we go. And then you may be wondering, well, I have an Expo marker, put that right there to show you in a minute, and then I have napkins, you'll see that it goes with the Expo marker. And we have cat food, dog food, and horse food, and that it's also from Sky Entertainment. Sky Entertainment makes lots of things for animals. And we have our feed chart. That's when the Expo marker comes in handy. So let's just take for instance, we got a feed beauty. You put beauty on the list, and then you put the person that's going to feed her. Just say Lucy. It's her day to feed beauty. There. And you're like, probably like, how did you get it to do that? And how are you going to erase it? Well, take some clear tape, get a piece of cardboard, some paper, and just draw lines through it and write feed chart, and then just... Put the little duct tape over it, and there you have it. And then you can erase it. Too. You can erase it like this. Just get one of your little paper towels and simply just wipe. So there you go. That is that. 
And then so away from the barn, we have our little hooks where you can hang up some tack. We have a little Sun Lily's equipment. And then we have that, that, and then we have the little hay feeder, which should be right here. And we have just this little tractor statue he rolls. And then we have our big briar bus, you know, the big briar bus. So that and that is my barn tour. Um, please put in the comments what you think about it and how much you liked it and what was your favorite part about it. I love to know you guys' opinions of that. So just remember to like, subscribe, and comment. Yay! You've reached the end of the video. Thank you for watching today may have been a pretty long vlog but please i thank you thank you thank you for watching thanks oh and i forgot one well never mind i don't know what i forgot uh probably lost it whatever it was thank you for watching bye oh and shout out again to Mackenzie garrett and Amaya and my sister. Thank you for watching.